I do apologize for the sunlight hitting my face. It is like 7.02 p.m. and it's still sunny out. And I don't know if I turn off the light would it help. Oh no. No, but we're gonna go for this bright yellow, very dramatic extended cat eye look. Um, tonight I'm gonna go see Prince Poppycock. Um, I don't know if you ever heard of him, if you have, because you probably do watch America's Got Talent. He was on last season, I think he was like the second runner-up or something. Uh, he was up against a little girl, can't think of her name, but yeah, he was like the second runner-up. But um, yeah, this is my bright look, it's kind of retro-ish because I'm just putting that pop of color in my eye. Everything else is just, you know, black, striped, I'm wearing jean, um, like capri pants and black flat shoes. So this is the only thing, oh yeah, and debating on red lips. Most likely we'll have red lips. But here we go, and let me quit rambling, and let's get on with the tutorial. So, here we go. So I just applied some um, Urban Decay Primer Potion on all over the eyelid, blended it all up here with my brow bone, right under the lid, and then I'm going to go with the NYX eyeshadow base in white. And I'm going to apply that all over my eyelid, and then in the corner. So, this will help the yellow pop, 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 and bring it up slightly. Like so. I do apologize for the sunlight again. Crazy, crazy. And yes, I am talking in this video because apparently some people they didn't like me not talking in my videos. You know who you are. <laughs> so here we go. Okay. And then I'm going to go ahead and start with my 120 palette. And I'm using this bright matte yellow right here. The camera doesn't pick it up. I do apologize. And that's the main and basic main color of the whole lid, of course. So I'm just going to pack it with my brush, pack, 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 and you want to make that very well covered. So I start off in the center, work my way up to the sides, like so. Right in the inner corner, and you could also apply it like right above the crease. You want to just make sure that color is very bold and bright. I mean, yes, yellow's bright already, but yeah. Once you've packed on as much color as you want, we're going to move on to the next step, which is the cat eyeliner. Stay tuned. Then you're going to take any kind of like vanilla type of color. I'm not going to pick up my palette, but it's right over here. And you're going to add it to your brow bone and blend out a little bit of the harshness of the yellow of that line up there. And just blend it a little bit, just to give a little bit of a sh um, highlight to your brow. Okay, and then just soften out the ends. You want to kind of just have it softened around the edges, like so. Okay. Sorry for the sunlight. Now with my Maybelline um, line stiletto that I just threw across the room. Hold on. <laughs> Sorry. I was like, I was shaking and go pew, out of my hand. Oh goodness, goodness. <laughs> okay, that was, I guess that was too much, too funny for me, I guess. But anyway. Whew. Okay, ready to grab the liner. Start from the edge right here. Extend it as far as you like. I'm gonna take it to there. To there. And then bring it in. And then fill in. Gracie, what up, my elf? I'm watching Santa pack up this summer and in the Caribbean. It's 
Santa just put a 12 pack of Pepsi up in that sleigh? I think so. And then you want small strokes from the inner corner and back up connecting it. Just for now, and then I'm going to go ahead and apply my false lash. I'm using this, these ones, I don't know if I like it because it's the first time I'm using them, but it's these ones with the red string. These are number twos. I don't know how I like them, so I'm going to go ahead and put them on without recording it, so I'll be right back. Now I'm going to go back with the NYX white um, eyeshadow base and apply it in the waterline of my eye. So, you can see it. Sorry for delaying again. I'm gonna keep apologizing till the sun sets, I guess. I don't know. And then take some matte eye, white eyeshadow and you guys set it. Just pat it on the base. So it can last longer, especially if you're going out dancing, clubbing. Or any nightly event. Like so. Okay. And then right under it, you gotta use a eyeliner. I'm using a new one called from it's from Maybelline. Master Drama by Eye Studio Midnight Masters. The colors are dark black. It's supposed to last 24 hours. And I don't know why I'm applying it for 24 hours. It'll probably be gone for some hours, but not 24 hours. Yeah, I dare go rambling again. Anyway, I'm gonna apply it right under the white. Like so. I filled in my eyebrows kind of lightly because I want this part to pop out. And I'll be right back with the leaves. And I'm using Red Revival from Maybelline. Now, why am I planning lip liner? Because I don't have a red lip liner. But that's the red. Sorry again for the sunlight. Um, this is the finished look a little bit. Um, I'm gonna apply blush later, so you'll fi see finished photos of the look. Um, I'll probably just use a little bit of bronzer, just a little bit to contour on the sides, and that's about it. I'm sorry, I'm shrinking down like this. I apologize. But. Very crazy look, huh? And I see my eye false lashes coming off a bit. I'm just gonna reattach that with a little bit of glue and ta da! And stay tuned. And I will also have video footage and photos of my evening going to see Prince. Hope you enjoy. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe, and talk to you later. Bye. Go!